lot easier with that. Thanks for joining me on this little bit of a bonus section to the original footage what I've just filmed. We're going to start this off in the car park down here at Saddle and I'm just going to cover a few camera angles what we've discovered while we've been here. So the road coming up to the car park, that's the first scene where Eli and Clint were actually walking up the road there. And just as you come through the gate here, you're welcomed by the Sergio Leone Monument. And the camera shot where uh, Clint Eastwood actually lit the cannon is roughly about here somewhere. So the cannon were fired towards the graveyard and that's where Eli actually fell off the horse. So a nice little information board. So we're going to walk down now to the graveyard. It's only probably about 100 metres away. So whilst I'm doing this walk, uh, comments please. Why are we interested in the spaghetti westerns? Is it the... Or is it the... Or is it just because you grew up with the spaghetti westerns on TV? That's my excuse. So we overlook in the graveyard now. We've got the sad hill sign. And also we have got a silhouette of Clint Eastwood. So we're walking a little bit further now. This is where uh, Eli, we fell off the horse and they got shot at again and they ended up against a gravestone. Now the only gravestones that I can actually see, with the exception to the crosses, is this one just here. Which as you can see, the centre circle of the graveyard is way down there. So we'll go down there, we'll check out uh, the, the graves. And whilst I'm walking down there, the last scene where Clint Eastwood was actually riding away into the distance was actually filmed on the hillside just behind there. And just for reference, I'm recording this in February 2023. It's looking like it is today, thanks to a team of uh, European volunteers, some from Turkey as well. This was actually all overgrown 
bushes, none of the uh, the crosses was here. So thanks to the volunteers, they've actually made it to what it is today. Even the inner circle was actually all overgrown. So they've done a great job in bringing this back to life. And being honest, even though it's early February and it's a weekend, this place was very busy yesterday. So uh, there's a lot of interest. So we buy the tree. This is roughly in the, in the correct position. I'm quite sure it's not the original tree. But as you can see, we've got Arch Stanton there. And right next to him, or we did have somewhere down here. Is this it? Yeah. We've got the grave unknown. Here. On, on, there's no name on it. There's no name here either. So we've got the two graves there, Arch Stenton and Unknown. And then as we walk over here, we're now entering the famous circle. So from what we discovered uh, yesterday, Clint Eastwood was over at the east side. We've got Eli just about here, which is on the southern side. And we've got Lee Van Cleef over to the north and when you see the photo you'll see on Lee Van Cleef you've got the hillside behind Clint Eastwood over the other side you've got the the two hills there and Eli you've got this hillside at the back here Yes, and there it goes, riding off into the distance. Listen, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give us a thumbs up if you have. And please, please check out our other videos. And until next time, thanks for watching everybody.